A UTSA professor has been studying the transmission of the coronavirus around the world. He says carriers of the virus who aren't showing any symptoms could be spreading it without knowing it. Eyewitness News reporter Vanessa Croy, why people need to pay attention to this silent threat. A video by the SciFair Fire Department simulates how germs are easily spread by just a cough. It hangs in the air. Droplets that linger in the air and cover surfaces. But what if someone coughs or sneezes and doesn't know that they're carrying the coronavirus? It's extremely contagious. UTSA mathematics professor Dr. Juan Gutierrez said asymptomatic carriers are a silent threat, driving the spread of the virus. Our best uh, chance at defeating this is to understand uh, what this pathogen is, to understand what are the dynamics of transmission. He said carriers without symptoms known to be contagious escape detection by public health surveillance. Because many people might feel well, they might feel healthy, they might not isolate themselves or seek any sort of medical attention, and they might be transmitting uh, the pathogen. National studies estimate that one person has the potential to spread the virus to three other people. But Dr. Gutierrez said research doesn't take into account asymptomatic carriers. In three months, one pathogen has covered the planet. After studying transmission in 13 other countries, he found one person could spread the virus to an average of 15 other people. People need to take, need to take this pathogen very seriously. Vanessa joins us live. Vanessa, has Dr. Gutierrez shared this research with city officials? Well, Deb, he has, and he's been submitting, he's been working on new models based on the city of San Antonio and submitting that information to city officials in the last day or so. But it's still unclear if that information will be included in the city's new projection website mentioned at the update tonight. Now, Dr. Gutierrez also told me that he has received some criticism over this research, but told me he stands by his theories. He also said there's so much unknown about the virus that it could take years before we fully understand what we're battling right now. Reporting live tonight, Vanessa Croy, Ken's 5 Eyewitness News.